predictions for AEW December 4th, 2019. I believe that Trent Beretta, Trent Maraschuto, or whatever you call it, um, Trent, question mark, Trent, will be the opener, and he will get the win against Phoenix. They're punishing the Lucha Bros, it seems. And it's not that bad. Um, Trent deserves it. Trent is... He's a good quality single star. He he was a fan favorite in ECW and WWE ECW, which, well, that was a long time ago, like over 10 years ago, it feels. And he's a great star. He's athletic. He's fit. He's a good look. I don't know about my skills, but the best friends are over. He could be a single star. It could be the Orange Cassidy and the Kentucky Gentleman. Karo Shida. They're just calling Shida. So it works for me. Versus Chris Statlander. I like uh, Statlander's energy. Not the most memorable moveset, but otherwise fine. Versus Illinois Champagne, Illinois. Shida has the winning streak. Looks pretty good. I'm looking forward to who, who will get the one Shida or Riho. Um, I forget what I said last week. Maybe I don't look forward to them. Pulling up the hype. Like, maybe... There's going to be four months of hype between for the Shida Riho match, but it's going to be pretty good. Maybe they have them tagged, te have them teased, bring them up, have the best winning record. Maybe they'll team up against Kong and Nila Nyla. A lot of possibilities there. Dustin Rhodes and the Young Bucks versus Sam Guevara and Santana and Ortiz, and I call them proud and powerful. I felt like this was like the week two match. Um, I don't really want the bad matches on Dynamite. I just wanted to see the Inner Circle do promos. This Rose doesn't wrestle in a while, I guess. I wonder if they're going to solve the injury. Or if I were them, I'd have him fight Hager. Or he could go find him on the ring side and then someone come out. Maybe Cody comes out. Probably no Omega. I don't know where I place it in the card. You could place it in the main event. I'm not really excited for the match because they've done it over and over again. Which you'll see. This match I'm looking forward to. Christopher Daniels versus Pentagon Jr. He has the arc on his chest. as seen all oh, the fonts covered around it. Pentagon Jr. has all those tattoos. I'm hoping it's... Christopher Daniels comes out as Pentagon Jr. T attacks Phoenix. Maybe that's how Trent Barata gets the win. Then Pentagon Jr. This is like a Legends match. Two main eventers here. Always World Champ versus Impact World Champ. Two TNA Legends. Illinois is really TNA territory. You can see Tannehill's being heel. Pentagon Jr. can't screw up the tag in African Phoenix. Hope they both dress up. Could be very good entertainment wise for the, the Pentagon suits. John Moxley versus Jordan Janela. Been there, done that. Janela has no wins. He's selling his 80s pay-per-views for his own card and wrestling fed. John Moxley will probably get the win. That's about it. Or your thoughts on subscribe. Uh, Phoenix will... Phoenix versus Trent is the opener. Uh, main event would be... I can see Sheeta main event, but I doubt it. John Moxley is a squash match. I think on Junior, I don't see happening. Because, like, it's Daniels. They haven't really had Pentagon Jr. main event. Then a circle. I think that's about it. If they have a... They should have, like, a promo. I don't think... It's not the most exciting card, but, like, hopefully they have, like, a... Inner circle promo at the end of that. Looks like the... Have an exciting t TV show thing. Great thoughts, like, subscribe.